What's up ladies? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. Today for you, I'm bringing you a fun video. This is gonna be what's inside my toiletry bag. Now, this isn't a bag, it's a caddy that I love to bring with me. So I'm gonna show you a couple different bags and things that I store my toiletries in because I bring a lot of toiletries. This is not a minimalist video, warning early warning. <laughs> but I'm going to show you guys all my favorite products, how I pack it, store it, how I like to keep things safe, all of that good stuff. And if you're into this sort of video, definitely consider subscribing and hitting that little bell so you guys are notified every time I post a video. I do a lot of lifestyle, mommy, organization videos here on my channel and I would just love to have you guys. I'm doing a whole travel series, so definitely check down below and see my uh, playlist all the other videos that I've already done and stay tuned for the videos in the future. I'm doing my updated what's in my carry-on, my personal item, all that good stuff. Now if you feel like depositing some positive energies, give your girl a thumbs up, I'd so appreciate it. Question of the day is how do you guys like to store your toiletries? I asked you guys this about the makeup bag, now let me know about the toiletries. Do you guys use a bag, a type of train case, is there a special product you like to do to keep um, your things safe? Let me know in the comments below. And without further ado, if you guys want to see how I pack my toiletries and all my favorite products, you can just watch guys so here's my little caddy each side has three pockets this side is like my hair stuff and what I like about it is it stands on the counter and I've shown you guys this before but I just wanted to show you guys again because um, I'm getting a little more into detail today about what is inside and how I store everything so I have these little clips I like to use these when I am curling my hair these ones keep my hair out of my face I also have ones if I wanted to um, pin my curls up. I have bobby pins and I have hair ties in this side. All right, now on this side, this is like the community area. My whole family uses this. Um, I have cotton squares to do toner, whatever. I have floss sticks, which you guys know I love my floss sticks. And then I have some Q-tips. So everybody just comes in the bathroom and uses my stuff. And then inside here, I have my two bags. And then I'll show you guys in a little bit. I have another little bag that goes in here. And I'll show you what's inside. But it just looks like this on top of my counter. What I usually like to do is keep it open. So I will open everything up and keep it sitting on top of my counter with everything. So that is my little caddy and I absolutely love it. Next up, we have me decanting all of my products. Well, most of them. I am making them into all of these travel size containers. Now I love these silicone ones and I did not like these harder ones because I had a leaker so I don't fully suggest them. I did not put a link for it unless I 100% agree with something. Um, I just have some mouthwash I'm putting in there which it doesn't seem like a likely container for it but I just thought it would work really well. I have some face scrub, I have some face wash, some S2K. I love this stuff you guys. Um, I really like it. It's super expensive so there are other alternatives. It's just what I use. Good jeans, I also use that. They last me forever because I only wash my face with my good stuff at night. Um, I have this juice beauty cleanser that I absolutely love. It's an oil cleanser, it's what you do before you wash. And then I have this Derma E, this is super affordable, I really like that. And then this is just some gum stuff. I have gum issues from um, one of my crowns, so I have to bring that with me as well. That's what ended up leaking, that container there. Then I have this Eminence Tropical uh, Vanilla, and it's SPF, it's a moisturizer, it's amazing. I love, love, love this. And on the pricier side, this is my La Mer, I love it, it heals my kids' sunburns, I mean, it's good stuff, but it's super pricey. So I'm gonna show you what's in this first pouch here. You guys saw me fill everything, and now I'm gonna be showing you how I organize within each pouch. Only thing that I'm missing out of here is my contact solution and my contact case. I have a cute little pink one, and I just, I can't find it anywhere, and I used up my contact solution, but that also goes in here. So this one's like my miscellaneous bag. I just have my deodorant. Then I have body lotion. This was, oh, um, I was just putting this in here for contact solution. This is mouth wash. This one still has the baggie on it. And then this is makeup remover. I feel like, um, 
I just stick, you know, even this could go in my face stuff. There's just not enough room, but it's all related. This is all my bathroom stuff. This is, I use everything at the same time, so. All right, you guys, so here is what it looks like. These ones I can't close, but they at least have a little bit of protection. But that's what the inside of this one looks like. All right, so I showed you guys before um, the top of this, but I just wanted to show you guys, I like these bags because they're not plastic. They don't stick to this one, and I already have them. And you know, I made the investment, so I just feel like I might as well use them. They were just sitting there, and I would switch them out every once in a while, but I was like, you know what? I travel a lot, I'm gonna get good use out of them. But I wanted to show you a couple other options. So like this one, this one you can put stuff in and slide it right in there. This one's kind of dirty, but it's the same concept and you put it in there. I love these ones. These ones are from Amazon. I've linked these multiple times. I will link them again for you guys, but I love these ones. Also, like this is a little mini packing cube. You could stick everything in here and do it. Let me show you guys what it would look like. Here's what it would look like. And then you could just slide it right in here like so. And then pull things out as you need to. That's why I love this stand-up caddy. It's just so, makes everything so accessible. And, and then it clears the counter and it just, everything's not everywhere. I just, I love this, you guys. I cannot um, speak more highly of it, even though it's plastic. I just love the organization of it and the efficiency. So... I didn't have these bags last time. I had um, a different bag, it was this one. It's the bigger one, this one actually won't fit in there, but there's a smaller version of this one. I'm just giving you guys, oh yeah, this one does fit in here. I'm just giving you guys examples. And then you could also stick this up, you know, if you don't mind it being taller, but. So those are a bunch of different bags you guys can use to organize it. Another thing I wanted to mention, you guys, are these bags. Now, it's close enough to Valentine's, maybe they still have some left, but if you have not gotten any of these, always, always during Valentine's, get these little bags. These are the bags that I put every single thing inside of to make sure everything stays clean and safe. And I just, I literally have a million of these. I have so many different kinds and they're just amazing to keep things wrinkled up. Even if you want to keep your hair ties in here, stick things in your purse. But I mostly use it because of the pressure and I don't like things to explode. I actually have a little clip of something that actually leaked and this protected my bag. So got to love these. And I wanted to show you guys, like, I don't know if you could see this, but this one leaked. Here is most of everything in its container, well, all the facial stuff with its label. I love how fresh and clean everything looks and everything did work out really well. So anyways, um, this is what it looks like inside. I'm getting ready to put them all in little bags and I'll show you guys what it looks like after that. So this is what it looks like after all the Ziploc bags. Trust me, take the extra precaution. This is the best hack ever. Me and my husband were just talking about, like he's witnessed it himself. The protection okay and I want to show you this this is like one of the bags that I use to protect something and look look at all that powder in here so it works okay I just wanted to show you guys this bag but it could have gotten inside of my bigger bag but luckily it was all contained inside of here okay you guys I have my shower curtain in here I'm putting this in here and then I'm gonna put my little headband to wash my face in there as well so I want to show you a couple of things that I've packed we're gonna look at this guy first so I got this um, there was a set, okay, so with this and this one right here. Um, but this is basically, I have two perfumes and my face mask and different stuff like that. I also am bringing a little brush. I don't know if you could see that right there, but um, I'll take everything out and show you guys a better look of what that all looks like. Now this is a pill case, but I'm putting my jewelry in it. I just think it's perfect to organize your jewelry into these little pouches because I'm bringing like little dainty jewelry. So it's perfect for jewelry. And then this is for my toothbrush case. Um, but yeah. Next up, I have a different face mask. This is just a sample from Clinique I wanted to try. I didn't end up using it, but I did get that. And then I have an Andula, Andulu, I don't know. <laughs> face mask and then I have some eye mask and then this Olex um, Henderson power peel and I use it with this real techniques brush I also have this glow recipe mask so I'm just bringing some of the masks that I have so I can use them up I love these Eminence products they're a little bit on the pricier side more than um, department stores but they're so amazing I mean drugstores but I love how natural and 
uh, amazing the ingredients are. So, you know, just one of those things. And this is Glow Recipe. I did like that one. I did use it and I haven't tried this one yet. But this is my perfume, it's by Ariana Grande. Absolutely love it. It's got a very sweet scent, so if you're not into sweet scents, don't get it. And then candy, I love this Canda pro uh, product candy. It smells so delicious. And then I have just this one here that was decanted in that little guy. Okay, you guys, so this is that little hair thing. I usually zip it. Um, now this is Volume Ness by J. Beverly Hills. I decanted it and put it inside of um, this little thing here. It's basically volumizing like powder. You open it at the top and then you just kind of dump it on your scalp to get some volume. I like having this on me. And then I stick my brush right on top. This is a, um, a wet and dry brush. And then I have this little teasing comb, amped up, love this. And then now this is just all of my like styling stuff for my hair. We have Hold Me Firm by J. Beverly Hills. We have a very dirty mousse up that looks like some sort of makeup on there. And then Perfect Hold, I always travel with that. And then I just have my Fragile and Mask Shampoo and Conditioner. I always, always travel with these as well. Now I've just been using J. Beverly Hills for a really long time and I enjoy um, their stuff. I'm going to be testing some new stuff coming up soon so stay tuned for that. Here's everything all inside of my suitcase. I love the way that it looks but it was also very safe. I have a whole video on this. This was actually in my check-in bag that I brought to the airport with me and I show you guys how I organize it. I will also put the travel playlist down there for you as well. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed my vacation toiletries video. I had so much fun doing this for you guys. If you could use anything I shared you here today, give your girl a thumbs up. I'd so appreciate it. Like I said, I'll list everything I can find for you in the down bar. And if you haven't done so already, what are you waiting for, girl? Subscribe and hit that little bell. And if you've made it all the way to the end of this video, thank you guys so much. I truly appreciate you. Give me some sort of emoji like a hairspray, a comb, a brush, some type of you know toiletry bathroom item down below and don't forget to answer that question how do you guys like to store all of your um, toiletry items for vacation let us all know in the comments below thank you guys again for spending the time with me today i truly appreciate you guys until next time i'm always your girl on the way